of Malzeal. Hello and welcome to a very special Halloween chapter of Lee's Logbook. I am Lee and this is uh, something that is called Survey Program. I don't, I don't know what Survey Program is. Uh, it's made by Toby Fox, who is the guy who made Undertale. Um, and I don't really know what to expect. It came out today, Halloween. Uh, happy Halloween to all of you, by the way. Also, side note, did you see that? Did you see that Lavender Town trailer for Let's Go? It was cool. I liked it. Uh, Lavender Town seems like a cool thing. Anyway, back to survey program. Uh, I'm gonna try out survey program. I'm gonna see what it's all about right, right now. We're gonna, we're gonna, we're gonna... Are you there? Yep, I'm here. Are we connected? Oh, okay. There's, there's a heart. Excellent. Truly excellent. Now, we may begin. First, you must create a vessel. Select the head that you prefer. Um... Whoa, that one's creepy! Actually, that one kind of looks like, um... Like Chara from the end of, uh, Undertale, where... She's got, like, the bleeding eye, or... He... She... I don't really know if Chara or... Frisk had... Cannon genders. Anyway, um... Um... I don't know. I, I like, um... I like that one. I'm gonna go with that one. Select the torso that you prefer. Uh, okay. So like a short sleeve shirt, a long sleeve shirt, a sweater, a sweater also. Those almost look the same to me, except that one has more pronounced hands, so I guess that one's kind of covering the hands, maybe. Ooh, that one's like a jacket. It's got like a, maybe like a zipper. And that one's got buttons. I like the one with the zipper, though. So I'm gonna go with the zipper one. That is the one. Select the legs that you prefer. <laughs> is, it, is there a difference between any of these? They all look exactly the same. Oh! Oh, wait, this one's the reverse. This one, the bigger leg, is on the the left instead of the right. All the other ones have the bigger leg on the right. You know what? I'm gonna go with the bigger leg on the left because uh, it's different. So why not? This is your body. Do you accept it? Uh, yeah. Yeah, I accept it. Excellent. You have created a wonderful form. Thank you. Now, let us shape its mind as your own. What is its favorite food? Pain? Sweet, soft, sour, salty, pain, and cold. Uh... See, there's a sneaking curiosity to say that pain is its favorite food, but I don't. I don't want to say that pain is its favorite food. Because I, I might do that on, like, if I ever play through this again, just to see what kind of differences I can find. This time, though, I'm going to play it straight. I'm going to play it just as honest as I can. So what is my favorite food? I'd probably say, out of all of these, uh, uh, sweet foods, I guess. Yeah? 
your favorite, your favorite blood type. Um, I, I, it is actually slipping my mind as to what blood type I am right now. Are C and D even blood types? Also, where's O? Isn't O a blood type? A, A, B, B, C, D. You know what? I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna say D. D is my favorite blood type. I don't think D is a blood type, though. What color does it like most? Uh, red. It likes red the most because red is my favorite color. Please give it a gift. Kindness, mind, ambition, bravery, or voice. Uh, I like... It's kind of because... It's kind of between... Oh, man. This is really hard, actually. I'm kind of between kindness and mind right now. Not that I don't like ambition, bravery, or voice. I'd love for it to have all five of these attributes, but if it could only have one, I think I would like it to have mind the most. How do you feel about your creation? It will not hear. Um... Love, hope, disgust, or fear? I have hope for my creation. I'm not disgusted by it or afraid of it. And I do love it. Do I love it? I've just created it. Can I say I've loved something that I've just created? I think I can. I think I can comfortably say. I, I, think, I think I have more hope for its future than I do anything. So I'm going to go with hope. Have you answered honestly? To the best of my ability I have. You acknowledge the possibility of pain and seizure. E yes? Understood. Name your vessel. I'm gonna name my vessel my name. I'm gonna name it Lee. We called it... Lee. And what about the creator? Your own name. Oh, my my name's Lee. So I guess we have the same name. I named it after myself, I guess. Lee. Of course. Of course. Of course. They are the same. Lee, thank you for your time, your answers, your wonderful creation will now be discarded. No one can choose who they are in this world. Your name is... Chris! Chris, if you do not wake up, we will be late for school. I will wait outside for you, all right? Clothes drawer. The drawer is mostly empty except for... A school cross country shirt with a tear in it. There are CDs under the bed. Classical, jazz, religious, ska. There's also a game console. It has one normal controller and one knockoff one. Your bed. It's a red wagon with a rusty birdcage in it. Looks like it's seen quite a few crashes. Wait, no. I already clicked that. What about the computer? It's a computer desk. There are many boxes under it filled with old books. There are many books. Tales of Snails, a storybook. Snails do not have tales, a scientific refutation. Can snails help your garden? Um, not really. An assigned copy of the History of Humans and Monsters by Gerson Boom.
It's a trash can. Somehow, it's emitting a pleasant floral scent. It's a landline phone, but you already have a cell phone. It's the TV. Doesn't seem to even be plugged in anymore. True? It's a chair... It's a chair heel. The beloved living room chair. <laughs> Chris, there you are. We might still be able to make it. No! No! Chris, it is a beautiful day today, is it not? I hope it stays this way when Asriel visits next week. But I wonder, after the excitement of university, will he still enjoy coming home to this little town? What is this? Is Undertale getting a sequel or is this a prequel? No, wait, that's Undyne as a cop. What is this? For any of you that have not played Undertale, this probably makes no sense to you. Definitely play Undertale. It's a good game. Um, what is happening? Oh, thank you, Toriel. So does everyone have a... Oh, Chris, we thought you weren't coming today. We're doing group projects this month. Uh, so walk around and find a partner, okay? Uh, how about... Yo, Chris, show up earlier next time. I ended up having to partner with Snowy. <laughs> now he keeps turning to me and saying, howdy, partner, like a cowboy. Crisp, I love Versors. Tem already have partner. Oh. Wait, did you just touch my face, Temmy? <laughs> it's a black and white hard-boiled egg. Sadly, seems like it already has a partner. <laughs> <laughs> ah, Chris, so late again, I see. Hmm? You need a partner? Sorry, I'm already partners with the second smartest student. Though, wait, Chris, now that I think about it, your unique skill set might help a lot on this assignment. Pfft, what? I actually want to get an A. Wow. That was... that was so mean. Hey Chris, what's up? Did you lose your pencil again? Here, you want the candy cane one or the one with lights on it? Huh? You want to be partners? Um, sorry, Birdly already asked me. But I could ask Miss Alfie's if we could make a group of three. I'll ask if you're sure. Uh... No, uh... Not yet. Yeah, I'm sure there's someone else you can ask. Click, click, tap, tap. Taken. Chris, you know Jackington and Caddy are always partners. We're the ultimate academic duo ever since our first gym class. It was hula hoop day and they ran out of hoops for us. So she used me instead. That's our origin story. All right, so we got to ask for a group of... Do you want to be partners? Yeah. No, no, wait. No, hold on. No, I do want to be partners. <laughs> I click not yet. Okay, I'll ask. Miss Elfies, um, is it okay if we have a group of three? Hey, what? I do not approve this. Abort! W what But but Chris doesn't have a... N Noelle, were you saying... She was just saying we're fine being alone! A actually, I just wanted to know if... Noelle, can you please speak up? Huh. Hi, Susie. Am I late? Oh, no, no, you're fine. We're, we're just uh, choosing partners for the next group project. And, um, Susie, you're with Chris. Great. And now that everyone's here, I'll write the assignment. Uh, ha has anyone seen the chalk? This is the third time it's gone missing, and uh, you, you all know I can't start class without some. <laughs> How about this? If no one speaks up, everyone gets in trouble. Uh, anyone? P -p Please? H hey, there might be a box in the supply closet. Miss Alfie's, why don't Susie and I... G good idea, Noel. Susie, since you came in last, uh, why don't you go get it for me? Whatever. And Chris, can you go with her and make sure she, um, actually gets it and, um, stays out of trouble? Thanks, Chris! See you later! 
Yo, Susie. What? Did she just eat the chalk? Chris. Didn't see you there. Hey. You didn't see anything just now, did you? Hmm. You can't even say. Chris. Hey. Let me tell you a secret. Quiet people piss me off. You think just because you don't say anything, I can't tell exactly what you're thinking? It's over. I caught Susie eating all the chalk. This was her last chance. Now she'll finally be expelled. <laughs> Come on, Chris. Don't act shocked. You know it's true. Everyone's waiting for it. Everyone wants it. So congrats, Chris. You got me. I'm done for. Just... Let me say one little thing. Seems like a waste to get expelled just for having a snack. So, Chris, if I know you're gonna pull the trigger, <laughs> why don't I just get expelled for some real carnage? Chris, how do you feel? About losing your face. Nah. Chris, you got a good mother. It'd be a shame to make her bury her child. All right, let's get this over with. We'll get more chalk, mosey back to class, and then Chris, you'll do our project. How's that sound? What? Don't bother answering. I was gonna answer. No. If you haven't gotten it by now, your choices don't matter. Okay, great. Let's go, freak. Maybe I should have given my character a voice. Potentially that would have changed things. Wait, I wanna explore. Chris? What, realize the baby classroom was a better fit for you? Hey, actually, I should come with you. Maybe I'll find a better partner in there. Nah, actually, let's not. All right, fine, you bully. God, can you walk any slower or what? No, I get it. Not used to walking around without someone holding your hand? Come on, freak. Not cool, okay? Well, here's the closet. Too bad. We were just starting to have fun. Hey, Chris, is it me or... Is it really dark in there? What's the holdup, Chris? You gonna go in or what? Fine! If you're gonna be a wimp, then I'll... We'll both go in at the same time! See? Why are you so scared? There's nothing in here but old papers. Let's try to find a light switch. That's weird. I can't find a switch. Guess it's further in. Can I not, though? Do I have a choice to not? I'm just gonna- Chris, if you leave me here, I'll- Okay, okay, alright, never mind, I'm coming. Don't worry about it, I'm coming, Susie. Ah, <sighs> kind of big for a closet, huh? You'd think we'd have reached the end by now. Hey, Chris, I think this closet's, uh, broken. There aren't any walls. Well, we've worked hard enough. If Alfie's wants chalk so bad, she can get it herself. Let's split. Had a feeling! I had a feeling! What the? Hey, this isn't funny! Let us out! Let us... The floor, it's...
What the heck? Is this a save point? At times, you see it flickering, the light only you can see. By second nature, you reach out and... Save. Okay. Should I... I get... Maybe I should split this into multiple episodes? Because we're already running... On time. I'm just gonna go a bit further. I'll, I'll make it a 30 minute episode today. So we'll go for 10 more minutes. And if we're still not done, I might... Make a second episode... Did you see that? Okay, I can't interact with the eye. That's fine. Also, what happened to Susie? Two. Oh! Okay, we're going down. Ah! Ah! Dodge! Okay, we're good. <laughs> oh, we're gonna save more. That's fine. You bathe your body in the light. A power shines within you, breaking through the darkness. Any pain you may have had melted away. HP fully restored. Haha, <laughs> I didn't lose any though. Save! Eye puzzle. File saved. Eye puzzle? In this land, only eyes blinded by darkness can see the way. Only eyes blinded by darkness. Aha! Got it! Cool! I guess. It's kind of creepy, but cool, I guess. What are these things? What is that doing? Also, I keep on seeing that shadow, and it's... Stop doing that! The, the shadow, not me breaking the things. Because me breaking the things, I'm just curious as to what they are. Ah! Oh, it's right. Hey, back off! Come any closer and I'll... C Chris? Whoa, wait, you've changed a lot, too. Phew. Hey, don't scare me like that, dumbass! Unless you want to get clocked in the face. <laughs> anyway, enough screwing around. We gotta find a way out of here. Um, where is here, anyway? Doesn't matter. You got us into this mess. You get us out. Lead the way, Chris. Okay. I don't know where we're going or why our clothes change. Oh my god, never mind. You walk way too slow. There's no run button. Oh my god, there's a run button. Guys, there's a run button? <laughs> hey Chris, there's someone up there waving at us. Any idea what they want? Run, Chris! Ah! Dodge, 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 whoa! Dodge, 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 dodge! Oh! Oh, I'm dodging. Okay. Okay, okay. Look, oh, oh, mm. We're good, we're good, we're good, we're good! Huh. 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 Chris, down here! Ah, no! No! Oh, I was hit! Okay, okay, oh, okay! Okay, okay. Okay, okay! Oh, we're good! Okay, we're good! Whew. We're alive. <laughs> not gonna lie, this is ge like genuinely. Oh, you're not dead. Sweet. Got any idea what the heck this place is? Me neither. Wonder if there's anyone in that building up there. Oh, so we're just gonna walk into a building now? Wait a second. Are these shops? 
It looks like a shop, but the door is locked and no one's inside. Okay, what about this one? It's locked. Okay, great. What about this one? It's locked. Fourth time's a charm? It's locked. Okay, all right. Learn my lesson. I'm gonna save. In front of you, a castle looms beneath the empty town. A black geyser emerges from it, piercing endlessly into the sky. The power of this place shines within you. Okay. I'm a save, I guess. And we're gonna go in the castle. A castle? Why the hell is there a castle inside a supply closet? Welcome, heroes. Who's there? Do not be alarmed. I am not your enemy. Please come forward, both of you. Welcome. I am the prince of this kingdom. The kingdom of darkness. Chris, Susie, there is a legend in this land. A legend that one day two heroes of light will arrive and fulfill the ancient prophecy foretold by time and space. Please, heroes, listen to my tale. Very well, then. We're gonna listen to his tale. Once upon a time, a legend was whispered among shadows. It was a legend of hope. It was a legend of dreams. It was a legend of light. It was a legend of dark. This is the legend of Delta Rune. For millennia, light and dark have lived in balance, bringing peace to the world. But if this harmony were to shatter, a terrible calamity would occur. The sky will run black with the terror, and the land will crack with fear. Then, her heart pounding, the earth will draw her final breath. Only then, shining with hope, three heroes appear at world's edge. A human, a monster, and a prince from the dark. Only they can seal the fountains and banish the angel's heaven. Only then will balance be restored and the world saved from destruction. Today, the fountain of darkness, the geyser that gives this land form, stands tall at the center of the kingdom. But recently, another fountain has appeared on the horizon and with it, the balance of light and dark begins to shift. Chris, Susie, thank you for listening to my long tale. I deeply believe you two are the heroes of the legend, that despite whatever enemies you may face, you two have the courage to save the world. Delta warriors, please, won't you accept your destiny? Uh, nah. What? Me? Some kind of hero or something? You got the wrong person. But, but Susie, without you, the, the world will... So what? If the world gets destroyed, it's none of my damn business. Might even be kind of fun, honestly. Anyway, Chris, if you want to play pretend with this weirdo, stick around. I'm gonna find a way out of here. Susie, wait! <laughs> the heroes are already running away! And they didn't even know I was here. My dad's gonna make me son of the month! Who the hell are you? I'm... The bad guy. You clowns wanna seal our dark fountain, huh? And still picturing you guys as clowns... Save the world from eternal darkness, huh? Uh, don't try to deny it. We both know you'll go east. It's your only way home. But I, Lancer, won't let you go there. 
and I've got a flawless two-step plan to ensure it. Step one, I thrash you. Step two, you lose. Hmm, nice plan, kid. Really? Yeah, actually. Mind if we use it on you instead? Whoa! Lancer busts in. What are we doing? Okay. Okay. Um. Uh. Oh, wait. Is this. I don't. Are we just. Act. Lancer. I'm gonna- I'm gonna check. Lancer. At- okay, attack 7, defense 1. Not to call a spade a spade, but he's a spade. <laughs> not enough to ride a motorcycle, so he set his bike on fire. Whoa! Hold clowns! This bike is fueled by victory! Whoa! Don't know how I got an axe, but, like, that's cool. Uh, act. Lancer, warning. You tell Lancer to watch out for Susie's attack. He readies himself. I love to get thrashed. Just kidding, that's you. Whoop! Ho ho ho! Nice try, Lancer. Um. Compliment. You tell Lancer you can't tell the difference between his clothes and his body. He seems flattered. His attack power went down. No, oh, you make my feelings do wheelies. S steel wheelies. Ow. That's hurting. Lancer's motorcycle is actually just a bike that's on fire. Um, I'm going to compliment him again. You try to compliment Lancer again, but he sees it as insincere. His attack power gets bugged. No! Oh no, I did a bad... Did you re did you not realize I can mask my self-esteem levels? Huh? Oh, nice try. I was ready for you that time. Wait, wait a second. My bike's running out of fuel. All right, you punkaroos. You had the luck of the draw this time, but next time, the losers will be you. <laughs> Bye, losers. I gotta get home before dinner. You won. Got zero experience and $36. Are you two okay? Um, allow me to introduce myself more properly. I am... Jeez, can you take off that hood? I can barely hear you under there. Uh, um, alright. Hello, everyone. I'm Ralsey. Chris, Susie. It's ever so wonderful to meet you. I'm certain we're going to become great friends and... Best way to leave is east, right? Yes! That's where we'll... Got it. See you at school, Chris. Um... I suppose it's just the two of us, then. Chris, I'm a prince, but... I, um, currently don't have any subjects. I've been waiting alone here. Um, my whole life for you two to arrive. So... I'm really happy to meet you. Hope we can be good friends, Chris. <laughs> Let's try to find Susie. She must be to the southeast. Uh, you can lead the way, Chris. Uh, alright. I need to find a save point. I found a save point. Ralsei, the Lonely Prince, is now your ally. The power of fluffy boys shines within you. Okay! Well! As the power of Fluffy Boys shines within me, I I guess I'm gonna make a little bit of a series out of this because this seems to be something more than I thought it was. I thought it was just gonna be a little something, but it seems to be a bigger something. So this will be part one of, I guess, a multiple part series of whatever this is. So... Yeah, if you enjoyed today's episode, please leave this video a like. And if you are interested in seeing more of this, uh, consider subscribing. And more will be sent directly to you. Plus, you'll be a part of Lee's League. By the way, don't forget to hit that notification bell so that you don't miss a thing. Also, I have a Twitter. You can follow me if you'd like. And uh, you can share the video if you uh, feel inclined to. It will be much, much, much appreciated. And also, just like super real talk for a second. I'm at like 166 subscribers uh, right now. And that is phenomenal. That's amazing. Um, 
Honestly, like, thank you, all the new people. Thank you for your comments, your words of encouragement, like, everything. I love you all. Um, and I guess, as always, I will see you next time.